Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast Review. Today we're going to take a look at the Earnhardt Family Racers, Dale the Intimidator Earnhardt Sr. and Dale Earnhardt Jr. Now before we get right into the review, let me discuss something. So, <clears throat> throughout the years of the Piston Cup, there have been a generation of Earnhardt racers, and each one of them shares the same surname, Earnhardt. Much like Strip the King Weathers, who comes from a family of Piston Cup racers that share the same surname, Weathers. And the Earnhardt family itself is also based off of the real Earnhardt family, which is a NASCAR family, much like like the Petty family that served as an obvious inspiration for the King's family, the Weathers family. The first Earnhardt racer, if not the first, was Dale the Intimidator Earnhardt Sr., Good Wrench No. 3, who raced from 1978 up until his death in 2001 at Florida Speedway. And during his racing career, he won the Piston Cup Rookie of the Year awards in 1979, as well as clinching his first win on that same year, then went on to win the Piston Cup seven times in, in 1980, 1986, 1987, 1990, 1991, 1993, and 1994, and due to his aggressive driving, he, received, he achieved the nickname, The Intimidator. And in 1998, he won the Florida 500 and founded Dale Earnhardt Incorporated. And in 2000, two years after, his son Dale Earnhardt Jr. arrived on the scene as number eight. Dale Earn, or should I say Dale Earnhardt Incorporated's number eight and won the Piston Cup Rookie of the Year awards in 2000 on that same year and won the Piston Cup Most Popular Driver four times between 2000 and 2006. And now with the, although Although Dale Earnhardt Jr.'s father, Dale Sr., wasn't seen in the, any of the Cars movies or films or video games, he was, was mentioned in one of the Cars comics. And now, without any further ado, let's dig right into the review. So first, we're going to start off with Dale the Intimidator Earnhardt Sr., Good Wrench number 3. So here we've got his... smirking facial expression, his black exterior paint job in number three on his headlight, one of his headlight stickers and his black grill which presents as a mustache. And on the hood we've got the Goodwrench logo and on both sides we've got the black rims on the black wall light year racing tires and the white number three and the exhaust pipes and no sponsor logos and the GM logo, which stands for General Motors, which is a division of Chevrolet, of which Dale Sr. himself is a Chevy. And on the top, we've got the number num number three, no name signature. In the trunk, the Goodwrench logo. And in the middle, we've got the GM logo, which are the initials for Goodwrench. And the number three on the taillight stickers. And now, for his son, Dale Earnhardt Jr. So we've got his happy facial expression, his dark red paint job and the headlight stickers with a number eight. And on the hood, we've got the Dale Earnhardt Incorporated logo, which is copyrighted. And on both sides, both sides we've got the white number eight on the iconic black letter E, which stands for Earn, which is for Earnhardt, the Dale Earnhardt Incorporated logo and the gas cap, 
the Lightyear logo on his front rims, on the grey rims, on the black wall Lightyear racing tires, and the exhaust pipes, and the sponsor logo is saying Piston Cup, Nitrate, Revolting, Octane Gain, Mood Springs, Vinylene, No Stall, Gaskets, Gas Sprin, Easy Idle, RPM, Low Torque Pistons, Leakless, Returning, Clutch Shade. And on the top we've got the number 8 and the and his name signature saying Dale Earnhardt Jr. And on the trunk we've got the we've got his name Dale Earnhardt Jr. which is has the big white letters saying J R which are stands for Jr. And on the back side we've got the taillight stickers with the number 8, the Dale Earnhardt Incorporated logo in the middle. And underneath it says 2007 Dale Earnhardt Incorporated, which is copyrighted. And that is it. Oh, and I also forgot to mention that Good Wrench is also a real life company along with Dale Earnhardt Incorporated. But what do you guys think? Which Earnhardt family racer is your favorite? Let me know what you think, as well as leaving suggestions of which car to review next in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And also, don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for another view, so please stay tuned. Goodbye now!